Greg says, regarding the Near Me webinar, you mentioned, Bradley, how do you feel about the exact match slug for an internal page, as was suggested? That would seem to be duplicate with the page SEO title. Um, yeah, maybe, but, I, I mean, without testing it, I, I don't know. I don't know if that would be a problem or not. I, I haven't tested that. Like, like I said, I'm looking at the Near Me um, opportunity <laughs> because I think there's a lot of potential there right now. So I'm looking at that from a pay-per-click standpoint, not an SEO standpoint. The SEO standpoint is... Uh, or angle has been covered in that course, um, but I'm I'm you know neck deep in PPC stuff right now. I'm not doing a whole lot of SEO stuff other than maintaining properties. So I probably won't. Um, I haven't had a chance to test that yet, Greg. But you know if if Angel says it's working and I didn't pay attention to that particular part about the internal page and how he's optimizing that, that's all covered in the training. But um you know I would just go through the training and follow his training and then test or test it on your own, one or the other. Anybody else want to comment on that? You, and what, what, what I think he's mentioning is having near me as the, so like keyword plus near me, right? And creating a page on the money site that's optimized for that and then using the near me in the slug. Um, Greg, I would probably keep the keyword out of the actual uh, page URL and put near me maybe in the page URL because he, remember, I think he said it works best with a branded domain anyways. If, if, if I do remember that part, Greg, and um, he, he mentioned that that using creating an internal page on an existing money site that, um, you know, you, you want a branded domain is better. Why is that? So that it's not an EMD, right? So it's not an EMD. So I would just probably leave the keyword out of it and just have a near me um, or some variation of the keyword so that the title is slightly different than the URL. But again, I haven't been through the course and I also haven't tested it, so I can't really answer that Marco what do you think yeah you know I'm trying to think it's it's working right now it's what Google wants so right now just give Google what it wants if at some point it changes you can just change the slug I mean you can just 301 it right I mean, let's ask dr. Gary Kerwin how, how he how he went about it did he do the the, the exact match is it branded how, how did he get away with ranking number one overnight for three uh, near me terms yeah yeah it's crazy I um it's funny because I, I like I said I spent two hours last night on keyword research and a little bit of time today because I've got a whole bunch of campaign ideas that I want to test <laughs> that I'm really excited about guys um, but, but the, cool. the, the great thing too and if if you happen to, to get in Greg is there's a Facebook group and and I'm in there and I'm, I'm probably going to ask this question anyway because I'd be interested to know what Angel and Mike's take on this are, and then I, I could I could probably get you a, a response. But I just get get into the course, man, and go and and hit, hit the Facebook group and just start ranking for everything near you. Yeah, and I'm going to be sharing my um, PPC campaign data with those guys, um, and there's potentially collaboration in the in the make in the cook in the works uh, because I think that's something that could be covered entirely um, you know as, as like a whole another add-on module or something like that but I, I've got a lot of campaigns that I started planning out already so I'm really anxious to test that and see what I can do with it all right